Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the new white joggers in GTA 5 and these are going to be the cargo joggers as we can no longer get the real white joggers seeing as the direct mode glitch no longer works. Anyway, before we get into it, if you're new here, please go down below and subscribe and if you do, don't forget to turn on post notifications so you won't miss any of my future uploads. Also, if you do go on to enjoy, please leave a like down below. Anyway, shout out to these people on screen now for commenting hashtag TJRH on my last video. Also, if you guys are in need of money in GTA 5, be sure to check out Digizani as they do offer cheap, fast and reliable cash and rank services. So if you want this, check out the link in the description. And also don't forget to use my code TJRH for 5% off your order. And with all that being said, let's get straight into the video. So the first thing you want to do is you want to come to any clothing store on the map. And you want to put a required amount of money inside of your bank. Now you want to equip the outfit you would like to keep as this glitch does delete all your saved outfits and you can either delete them all yourself or by doing a glitch they will get deleted either way. And once you have done so you want to open your pause menu and go to online swap character. And by the way for this glitch to work you will need your main character to be in slot 1 and it will also need to be a male. And now you want to make a new female character in slot 2 and if you already have one uh, you will need to delete it and make a new one. And if you do get this alert you want to accept it. Now once you're in this menu make sure it is a female and then you want to hit save and continue and name your character anything. And then once you take this picture, you should load it into a public session. And then once you load in, you want to enable passive mode, so no one can mess you up whilst you're doing a glitch. And then you want to open your pause menu, and check to see if you have any clothing stores on your map. And if you do, just go to one, but if you do not, find a new session, and they should appear. And then once you've made it to a clothing store, you want to head inside, and you want to go to the accessories menu, over at the back of the store. So, just over here. And then you want to go on the accessories menu, and you want to remove any accessories, that come with your outfit so most standard outfits do come with earrings so make sure you take those off and then once you've done so you want to go into gloves and equip the black woolen gloves and now you want to head over to shoes and on shoes you want to equip the shoes uh, that you want with your joggers so I'll leave a list in the description of which shoes on the female equal which shoes on the male so I'm going to be equipping these Deluxe Midnight Combat and these will give me the all white sports shoes and anyway once you have picked your shoes uh, you want to go over to the pants section and on this menu you want to go down to sports pants and equip the first ones so the spotted muscle pants and once you equip these you want to go to the uh, top section uh, which is just behind you and now on tops go down to bikinis and you want to equip the black bikini yeah so equip this one and now you want to go to the front desk and you want to save this outfit to slot 2 so just save it to slot 2 and once you have done so you want to open your interaction menu and you want to take the easy way out and this this will force the game to save and once you spawn out on foot you want to open your pause menu and you want to go to creator and start this up and once you load into this menu you want to make a new land race and now from here you want to make uh, you want to fill in the race details so the title description and photo do not matter and they can be anything and now what does matter you want to make sure maximum players is set to 3 and also set the route type to point to point and if you want to make this process a little bit quicker you can choose any supercar and once you have done so you want to open your map and you want to warp over to the airport Shoot, 
And now you want to place a trigger anywhere, it doesn't really matter. And then take a photo of anything for the lobby camera. And now you want to place checkpoints until the race is at least one mile long, as if it isn't, it will not allow you to test it. So just make sure it's at least one mile. And once you've done so, just test the race. And once you have finished, you should get this alert here. So you want to accept this alert. And now you want to open your pause menu and go to online choose character. And once you're here, you want to delete your female character. Now this part is important, so you want to return to story mode. Uh, so that's B for Xbox, or Circle for PS4. And then once you load in, just open your pause menu, and start a new online invite only session. Now you should spawn in with the outfit you chose to keep at the beginning so uh, you want to go save this outfit in any clothing store. And make sure you save this to slot 10. And you should also notice that the outfit from the female has transferred over. And anyway what you want to do from here is you want to go to the pants section. And on this you want to go into cargo pants. And you want to equip any of these large cargoes, so if you want the white ones, equip the ones that are called the light grey, as they're mostly white. Or if you want to, equip any of these, depending on which colour you want. And I'll show you in a bit, if you want uh, to get all of these colours, uh, you can do the next part over and over again. And I'll show you what I mean later. Anyway, I'm going to equip these ones, and once you have equipped the colour you want, you want to go to the shoes. And on shoes, you want to go onto boots. And you want to equip any of the ones that make the pants tuck into them. And once you've done so, you can either remove your top or keep it on, it doesn't really matter. And for this next bit, you will need an earpiece. So if you don't have one, you can purchase one from any ammunition store. But you do not want to equip it just yet. And you want to open your pause menu and you want to go to jobs and go to play jobs, Rockstar Created, and you want to go on versus and stop Crooked Cop. And then in this menu, you want to set the clothing to player owned and then invite anyone and start this up. And in this menu, you want to go down to owned outfit and scroll one to the right and you should get this, but don't worry about the top. Uh, it will turn into a normal t-shirt afterwards and you will be able to change that t-shirt into whatever you want to. Now once you spawn in you want to open your interaction menu and go to style and you want to go into accessories and equip your earpiece and now you want to go to the clothing store in the mission so that when you quit you will spawn closer to the clothing store. And once you're here just make sure your earpiece is still equipped and then you want to quit the job by using your phone. And once you spawn in, you want to go to the clothing store. And then you should notice your top has turned into a normal black t-shirt. And from it, go save it. And you want to make sure you don't save it in slot 1. So if you're going to keep doing this with different joggers, just make sure you do not save any in slot 1. And you can also customise this as much as you want to. However, you cannot change the shoes as it will go back to normal cargo pants. And if you want to do this again but with a different colour, all you need to do is go and equip the other colour pants and also equip boots.
Now just open your post menu and you want to go to jobs and go down to reverses and stop crooked cop. And in this menu, you want to set the clothing to player owned and then invite anyone and start this up. And in this menu, go down to owned outfits. You want to scroll one to the right and then just ready up. Now equip your earpiece and then go to the clothing store in the mission. And then just check your earpiece, it's still equipped, and then quit the job by using your phone. And once you spawn in, just go to a clothing store and customize this as much as you want to and save it. And if you want to keep doing this with other colours, just make sure you don't save them to slot 1. And if you want to do this with all the colours, just do what I showed you over and over again, except for with the different colours. And anyway, that's it for this video, so hopefully you did enjoy. And of course, if you did, please leave a like down below. And if you are new here and you made it this far into the video, please subscribe. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, have an amazing day or night wherever you are. And I'll see you all in the next one.